Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Forza Motorsport 3. Today is episode number 33. If you want to help support the channel, then leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe, and feel free to check out the other videos in the Forza Mega Series. Now let's get into the content. This video was streamed live on Twitch. Come watch us live with the link in the description. If you want to get cheap game keys for Xbox, PlayStation, or PC, then check out Eniba in the description down below. All right, so we're here for the ultimate speed shootout now. Uh, we're going to start out with Sunset Peninsula, Amalfi Coast, Sedona, and then Sebring. Let's go. All right, here we go. Porsche. See, the reason this car's dangerous is not the fact that it's unstable or anything like that. It's the fact that that engine just spins up so quick. You end up going from, like, zero revs to max revs. It literally a press of the throttle. To be honest, this is upgraded as well. This is also the fastest car that we've driven yet. And the most expensive. We're now down to like 350 grand, which more than likely means we're gonna have to sell this car afterwards. And I'm hoping that we get a substantial credit bonus back. Um, I know for the Lamborghini events, we're gonna be taking the Reventon. I'm not buying another car for that. Ah, oh, shit. quick it is it's not ideal there this is not a bad song Cardo. there's actually an artist I listen to called Vise who makes songs similar to this Cause tomorrow is another day. we had today we've had four today i just noticed oh that's pretty cool we've got a decent number of subs Woohoo! we got to a really high speed as well did we get out to 200 i wasn't actually paying attention <laughs> three of them being you Cotto. yes i appreciate it man Holy crap. Yeah, so Kodo, on Sunday, I'm going to be sorting out the videos from today, yesterday. Basically, the last four streams. Um, because I've not been able to upload them because of the license being expired. 
now that I, uh, I'm going to be buying the license on the 4th, because that way it means that um, I don't have to worry about the copyright stuff. I don't have to worry about, like, money and shit. Because typically I get paid at the start of the month. So if I pay for the Monster Cat at the start of the month, money's never a question. It, obviously, I could have bought it when it expired. But the problem with that, then, is if I've got less money next month, at the end of the month, I'm fucked. So, I had to wait for that. 20% uh, discount on driveline upgrades by Porsche Motorsport. Ooh, nice. 50 million years is a long time. Not bad. Oh, is it shout? Uh, the race have been pretty good. We're in uh, Porsche Carrera, also known as the Paul Walker Mobile. Oh! That thing was really struggling to get up that hill. Such a beautiful engine. What's even better is if you watch this on YouTube, you actually don't have the music in the background, so you get the full enjoyment of the engine noise. Let's go. Deliberately did not shift up then. Yo, Forza does it justice through those tunnels. I'm not gonna lie, this track is not ideal for anything above probably A class or S class. I think it becomes less enjoyable and more an actual, like, chore. going. Ah, drive! <laughs> I'm not really a fan of Rocket League. It's just such... I'm not a fan of anything competitive or anything that's multiplayer only. Because multiplayer only games typically aren't that enjoyable as a single player experience if they offer them. Yo, Kodo! What is with the gifted subs, man? It's our fourth sub today. Legend. Well, thank you very much for that gifted sub, man. Wasn't even doing competitive. It was just a chore, expecting something, and he misses. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, appreciate it, Kodo, man. Got a little bit of other engine noise mixed in with that as well. I am really struggling. Like, I kid you not, I'm struggling to drive this car though. Surprised I haven't pull walked it yet. I need you. I need you. I'm literally swapping between first and second gear. Stream has crashed. My internet is having problems. Oh dear. I will fix it in just a second. But I gotta record this clip. Oh 
Hopefully it fixes itself. Is it still recording? Come on, please tell me you're still recording. Give me the place! Ah, I got it just in the end. Woo! Okay, now I've got to fix uh, internet. Woo, that was very close. Right, and we got a 20% discount on intake manifold and throttle body upgrades. Here we go. Internet is back up and running. Stream is back live. I do like the way that I do the recording setups now. Because I can record and stream. But if something happens on stream, it's quite easy to fix. Because at the moment, I'm focused on the YouTube side of it. So if the stream crashes, the stream crashes. I gotta upload my uh, previous streams. I haven't done it in a while. I might know you. Oh yeah, um, the conversation about the competitive games that we were on about before everything crashed out. Not really a fan of competitive shit. Multiplayer stuff doesn't really satisfy me. Hands, you saw nothing. What are you on about? <laughs> oh, I think the bot's buggered. The bot might have disconnected. Crap. Yeah, port nut is not my kind of thing. It fought shite. need to um yeah let's make a good game of ruin it it's a lot of developers nowadays but a lot of developers are copying fortnite and fortnite was obviously a good game that's turned crap so every other game that they're copying it's just crap yeah i'll have to uh reboot the stream in just a moment because uh for some reason i now have 114 chatters in my chat according to my bot <laughs> Which is fucking not true. Crap. 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 We should get a crap counter, actually. I'll set up a crap counter. So every time I say crap, or a crap moment happens, we have a crap counter go off. This is getting demonetized because I've said crap so many times. <laughs> crap. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> Someone's just watching this right now on YouTube like, Who the fuck is this guy? That's basically the same as the Chinese rap version of that Chinese rap joke. So, <laughs> I've already heard it. <laughs> I do need to reboot my um, 
bot software. Because it was supposed to have said hi to hands, but it just didn't. So I'll reboot the bot software, get that back up and running. Help is on the way. I'm not a fan of rap unless it's got a really good beat behind it. Because I'm not really a fan of, like, the lyric side of stuff. Like, Nat by Eminem is just fucking amazing because that beat is killer. They say these bars are like COVID. You get them right off the bat. Infected with SARS and Corona. Like, you took a bite off of that. And it goes from Martian to human. That's how the virus attacks. They come out with emotion machine guns by trying to fight off a gnat. Such a tune. Um, we now got a 20% discount on intercooler upgrades. Nice. All right, here we go. Yeah, that list is for um, the gifted sub that we'll be doing at the end of the stream today. Holy crap. That's beautiful. <laughs> Holy fuck. There you go. Not bad. When did the Simbos get that much damage? I ain't complaining. Fuck the sim boss. <laughs> oh, I got to do the 100 damage for Kodo as well. No, 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 no. I haven't got a drink here, actually. I probably need to grab a bottle of water. Ah! That's not a sound I want to be reproducing again. <laughs> Then look in your eyes. <laughs> Let me clip it. <laughs> Go on then. I don't care. I don't care anymore. You don't bother me. Uh. Yeah, go on then. It's funny. <laughs> Honestly, the amount of dumb, dumbass noises that have come out of my mouth today is just fucking ridiculous. It's only going to get worse. Because when there's no one in the house, I don't have the embarrassment factor anymore. To be fair, my embarrassment factor is very slim because everyone knows that I do Twitch streaming and that I'm an absolute retard on camera. <laughs> but, you know. Look in your eyes. Make them S noises. You do realize you don't have to censor the word sex. It's not a fucking weird word. <laughs> shadow ban. I I'm not being shadow banned. Chances. A shadow ban does not exist. It does not exist on TikTok. It does not exist on anything. It doesn't exist. A lot of creators just get in a tizzy because servers just don't respond as quick as they like them. So because it comes up with like zero views or whatever, they're like, oh no, I'm shadow banned. Oh, every single video I'm posting is shadow banned. Oh, I'm going to go cry. Oh. Like, fuck off, you uneducated swine. Learn how technology works before you start bitching that you're shadow banned. And the ones that go, oh, I haven't got as many views as I used to. I think I'm shadow banned. No, you've just turned into a boring cunt. <laughs> oh, it's funny. It's funny. He's funny. <laughs> 
We got seven grand there, which is not too bad. 5,500 XP. Blah! It's a lovely noise. And we got 13 grand for that. I need to get that 348 back up to one mil. Very quick. All right, so we're here with the Lamborghini versus Ferrari. This is the final event on the Manufacturer Championship before we are done with the Manufacturer events. And I can carry on with the Amateur events after that. Uh, and this is Lamborghini v Ferrari. We are taking the Reventon, of course. Why would you not? Starting off with Miguelo, moving on to Maple Valley Full Circuit. This is the first time we're going around the full circuit in this game. Same with uh, Circuit de Catalunya. I don't think we've gone around the full circuit in this either. So, looking forward to that. And then Silverstone International. Let's get going. Monday left me broken. Tuesday I was done with hoping. <laughs> what a fucking vibe. Ah, oh, there we go. Now, the one thing I love about this car, and a lot of people like, the interior is so futuristic. Like, look at the dashboard. You've got a G-Force meter. You've got a really futuristic-looking rev counter. I think this was where Lamborghini's design actually started from, with the digital displays. Because I think this was one of the... If not the first Lamborghini that had a fully digital display. Proper like fighter jet dashboard. And obviously it has that percentage of like the percentage of the VMAX. Or the top speed of the car. It's lovely. It's a lovely vehicle. Yeah, so this car is definitely inspired by a fighter jet. Guaranteed. But the thing is, I think it inspired a lot of future Lamborghinis as well. Because people love the design of this so much. Because the other older Lamborghinis, they didn't have these sharp lines that you see. And I think when they made this, they obviously inspired it by a fighter jet. So they made a lot of the lines that were on the old Gallardo a lot sharper. And they added extra shape to it. Like extra sharp shapes. And all that. And I think by that point... I think that's why this car sort of designed a lot of future Lamborghinis. More than people realise. And I think because this game, this car was in this game. I think that's why it got the recognition it deserved. Because a lot of people love the Lamborghini in this game. Guaranteed. You were mine. Ah, nah, nah. Fucking fly is just gonna be flying around my room. I just heard something go slap in my fan. I think I think it just went into my fan and I hope it got his head chopped off. Little bastard. It's been annoying me for ages. It wasn't in FH4, was it? I didn't think the Reventon was in Horizon 4. I thought it was Horizon 5. Is it? Must be an exclusive one then. I can't believe I played FH4 and did not know that this car was in it. Yeah, I'm going to be buying Horizon 4 again, but on Steam, just so I have the Steam option available to me. You're the only girl, my, you're the only, you're the only girl, my, my, my. You were 
Nice. I'm so excited to finish this. Honestly, like finishing Motorsport 3, I've never finished it, ever. I've never finished Motorsport 4, but Motorsport 3 was the game I played as a kid so much. And I actually played like Korea. As a kid, I very rarely played career modes on games because I just didn't have the attention span for it. But this, I played. I think I got to level 30, though, so I'm already well beyond what I was before. There we go. We got nine grand. Not too bad. 7,300. We got a 10% discount on intake manifold and throttle body and oil cooling upgrades. Call it go. Hands, I'm not even kidding. That was exactly what Kodo told me, and I will tell you exactly what I told Kodo. I've forgotten what I told Kodo. <laughs> <laughs> what did I say? <laughs> what did I say? I forgot what I said. It was something about karate or something. About smacking the fly, I came out with a really good response. I completely forgot what it is now. <laughs> I was like sat there like thinking and I was like Fuck I forgot. I've forgotten the bloody thing. Oh wow, we're back on this track again. This is the first time we've actually gone around the full track. Jackie Chan, that was it. I said, I'm not Jackie Chan. I'm not gonna karate kick a fly or like try slap a fly out of midair. Going well for the night, but being polite. Fly, you're a bitch. Yeah, you heard me. Get out. <laughs> Having a conversation with a fly. Somebody booked me into a mental hospital. Whoa, make broken plus fix him. No, I am not fixable. I will have a look in just a moment. Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. Ding, dong, ding, dong, ding, dong, ding. I love this song. If you haven't heard this song before, it is a vibe.
Yeah, this would have been the same era. <laughs> Mech does not work. Mech has never worked, let's be honest. My brain's broke. I kind of wanted this done by five hours on the clock. Well, I wanted this done by 4.30 because then I'd be done before five hours on the clock, but... Clearly that's not happening! A Lamborghini was really nice to drive around there though, I'll be honest. I really enjoyed driving that. We're getting close to, uh, uh, what's it called? Next level. We've got 10% discount on air filter upgrades by ITG Italy. It, it, it is at I give up. I'm going to sleep. Alright, here we go. Those are some beautiful rims, i got to be honest. I want to see my graveyard of flies. No thanks. To be honest, I had a dead wasp on my windowsill for about three or four days. I only just got rid of it. But to be honest, like, that wasp was pissing me off. I didn't want to go near it. And on the off chance that it would wake up if I touched it. So I just left it there and made sure it didn't move. Because, again, I fucking hate anything that flies. But I specifically hate moths even more because I know they fly in your face. And that's even worse. Yeah, I mean, I don't really have any many bugs in here. I know bugs like to live in houses and shit nowadays. They're fucking crazy dope bastards. But no, I don't really have many bug problems. Sometimes I get the occasional wasp come in and I'm just like, get the fuck out. I get a fly that normally comes in every so often, but normally they disappear. This bastard's being stubborn. So you know, one thing I don't understand about Circuit Catalonia, right? So they have, um, oh shit, that was not good. So they have that curved section at the back. You see where the red is of the track. That curved section is the new layout for the circuit, right? And then they have that cut out bit in the middle. What they did when they modified the layout is they extended, yo send, welcome back to the stream. What they did is they extended that out by a fraction of a distance, which is fair enough. And then they got rid of the inside bit completely. The old layout. Which makes no sense. Why didn't they just keep the old layout and have the new layout there? Because some things might want that tighter corner. Some racing series or whatever. Seems really strange. Yeah. <clears throat> So yeah, everyone stick around to the end of the stream because we're gifting that free gifted sub at the end. Thanks to Kodo's four subs today. It's crazy. Nah, the, uh, the free one gets gifted out to a random person. Gifted to anyone that's been in the stream today. So. I mean, you've had one. You can still win another one. I just spin the wheel. Whoever's been in here gets a chance. Even if it's the first time they've ever been here. I mean, you think Kodo won the first time he ever been here. 
Let's be honest. I think it was you that won. One, didn't you? Or if it's you, I assume you get the sub. But I think Twitch works it all out. We got seven grand there. Not bad. We got a 10% discount on ignition upgrades by Magneti Morelli. These are available on cars made by Alfa, Ferrari, Fiat, Lamborghini, Lancia, Maserati, and Pagani. Woohoo! Ding, 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 ding. Ow! Tell me why. I love Streaking. It's one of my most favorite songs. Like, if I was to have a playlist of 25 songs that I think are amazing, Streaking is one of those. It's in my top 25. Granted, I don't listen to it often, but it is one of those songs that I'm like, when it comes on, best song in the world. No, am I a cripple by all that you've done? I'm wondering. <laughs> The fact is, this is one of the easiest songs to play on guitar. It, it sounds amazing, and you can play it fairly easily. I'm a massive fan of like songs that have heavy guitar riffs as well. Not like that really weird offbeat shit, like just heavy like that kind of shit. Similar to um. What's that? Wake Me Up by um, Evanescence. I'm not sure what the song, the actual song name is, but it's that song. Doomish Guitar Drop. Do you know what? I really wish that someone could... I, I'm going to do some research and see if uh, anyone's mapped any Doom songs for um, Clone Hero. Because if they have, I'm playing them. Because Doom songs for Guitar Hero seems like... I mean, they could make a Doom pack quite easily and get a load of songs for, for Guitar Hero. If only Guitar Hero still existed, that is. I mean, the last Guitar Hero game came out in 2015, and that was Guitar Hero Live. They haven't made a single one since. Um, apparently, since the Xbox acquisition of Activision, uh, Xbox is trying to push for another... Um, what's it called? Trying to push for another Guitar Hero. Which I really hope they do. Because I want to be able to play Guitar Hero again. Please, Microsoft, if you're listening to this, make Guitar Hero a thing again. You have so much money, it doesn't matter if you lose a bit. Just make some of us gamers happy. Bring me back to life. Is that what it's called? Yeah, it's, 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 um, it's basically their top hit. Even though it's not in my top 25 of songs. But, like, it, it's a fucking top hit. I love it. It's got that heavy, like... A heavy guitar riff is what I love in a song. So, if it's got a heavy riff, I don't care. I'm a vibe to it. Here we go from heavy guitar riff to a uh, time warp by Sub Focus. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. What a variety of music we're listening to. Meow, 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 meow,
Uh, alright. We got eight grand for that one. Not bad. Let's go, let's go. Get my rewards. Get my rewards. We got 13 grand. Yeah, let's go. And that is every single manufacturer event done. Uh, for the next few episodes, we're going to move on to amateur. I think we'll get five episodes out of this. And then, uh, we basically got that first big chunk done just got this middle chunk to get rid of the tools and all that and then we're pretty much in the final legs to be honest like these ones are fairly quick to finish so looking forward to it looking forward to it so thank you guys so much for watching if you did enjoy be sure to leave a like comment down below and subscribe and i will see you in the next one peace out